What the heck, bra? What the heck? What the heck, zooms? What the hey? heck, bra? Yeah, What's happening? You good? Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. What the heck? We got a Grammy, bro. You got a Grammy. We Just have a Grammy. Show off you as the yeah, Grammy. This is my Grammy. <laughs> uh, Tyler needs to bring the real Grammy, though, to Spaza Talk. Yeah, yeah. What do you think, bro? Nah, she might get robbed on the way. <laughs> <laughs> and we melt the gold. <laughs> we melt the gold. No, we'll definitely make sure we look after her. But, man. But shout out to her. Shout man. out to her, yeah, right? She's doing big things. Big, major things. And that's what I think that's the first thing she said. What the heck? What, the heck? what a true South African. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I was laughing. I'm glad that's something. what she's taking and uh, and showcasing to the world. For sure, uh, yeah. Her real yeah. self, her authentic self. You understand? Agna matweng nya not easy. Yeah, mm. which which is which is dope. I mean, yeah. Fraser City, we, we don't want to change. You shouldn't change, and especially when oh, we export you. Yeah, and, she, and she's like, she's just being a true she's South African. She's embracing it. Like yeah. she's embracing being South African. Big time, right? Which is amazing. Yeah. But what do you think of the boys, boy? Aye. I'm even wearing a tee Aye. just to represent. Aye. South Africa is doing well, bro. Nah. Generally, South Africa in general is doing well. But what I hate is Tolaman you're saying Bakale attention. Yeah. And then something. No, 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 no. We, 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 we have. I think we're being unfair a little bit. Okay. As a nation. Sure. And I'll tell you why because. We've given the box a chance. We've given the the protein Pro a, a chance. Yeah. And Bafana Bafana have exceeded our expectations. Firstly, already they have. I know they've exceeded yours. Mine, hundred and ten percent. They right? have. Yeah. So already, whatever they gave us from here, I think it's a shout out to them. Okay. Yeah. Because right semis, now, if we, semis yeah, are big. Yes. Thing is, we, we, we if we put an expectation over to them as win the final, now we're putting things yeah. that were done. When <laughs> last did they win the final? Back 96. Then? 96. 96 is. Yeah, for sure. So they went. Firstly, we were never their favorites to win it. So yeah. I don't. I don't think we should put that pressure on ourselves. Firstly, so you, we are supporting them. I think we should carry on supporting okay. them and not be ashamed to support them. And I'm proud of you, bro. Ah, uh, you know, man. You know, man. I had to show up. I had to. I doubted them all along, and they proved me wrong. So that's why I had to rock this tea, and it's not even a Friday. Yeah. <laughs> and normally we rock these on Fridays. Right? Normally it's, it's like Friday, Friday, Friday yeah. Mafana Friday, you know? But this one is a weird one because um, we sort of have like um, the games in during the week. Yeah. Um, so it's a, you know, on a Wednesday. Sure. And if it was on a Friday, it would be a different story. True. True or a Saturday. Or a Saturday. Yeah, we can't yeah. truly celebrate properly today, tonight, or whenever it happens. Uh, um, maybe you. Uh, yeah. <laughs> do 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 you think Santon will be empty? Do you think the clubs will be empty? I not don't tonight, think so. Definitely not. Definitely not tonight. Not. People were grooving. Dude, people didn't generally were grooving. Oh yeah, born. That's crazy. Now it's the month of love. There's every excuse to be out there. Oh, in the month of love. Yeah. Uh, every excuse. Shouldn't you be at home with the loved one? Hey, some homies are not taken. Okay, okay. Yeah. So they're looking. So they out there creeping. Okay, okay, fair and enough. the ladies are also creeping because they want <laughs> roses. Yeah. They want they want to be spoiled on Valentine's sure. Day. Somebody asked actually, like, what's the point of Valentine's Day? I mean, look, from a gent side, I get it. Like you ask yourself, like, you know, or they what what did they ask if I'm paraphrasing properly? They asked, um, why isn't it both our Valentines? Should be. But then, you know, somebody's like, you, we have to make it a little bit fun and actually just ask the women as you know, as our Valentines and not the other way around. Yeah. Imagine, it, would you like to be asked as a gent, would you be my Valentine? Every Valentine's? No. Exactly. We just had load shading there, yeah. actually, guys. Sorry, we just had load, load. Did you see the flash flash <laughs> flickering? <laughs> yeah, but um, our generator kicked in very quickly. Shout out to our sponsors, by the way, for the studio. Uh, perfect moment to give them a shout out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, kicked in very quickly. Yeah, but shout out to them. But yeah, bro, um, that's just what I think about. That's what I heard about Valentine's. Right? Sure. What do you think? Well, I think, man, Valentine's is for everyone. Sure, yeah. All yeah. I'll say is check out the new chicken licking ad. Okay. It's around Valentine's. Uh, Amazing. But it's like it, it oh, yeah. goes back to, um, yo. BC, yeah, yeah, before Christ. <laughs> <laughs> like showing you the, a different, um, a, uh, who's this, Cupid. So okay. when Cupid was a young boy, yes. right? But uh, hasn't Cupid always been small? <laughs> no, no, <laughs> but he grows up <laughs> in that bed. Oh, there's bad. like, okay. he's not even Cupid, he's Cupido. Or something. <laughs> Cupido. <laughs> 
and he helps people fall in love, <laughs> okay, right? Sure. With his buen arrow. Yeah. He helps bears fall in love with a teddy bear. Like, yeah. Capito is on fire. Yeah, it it just sounds amazing. It sounds amazing. But then they're like, yeah, love was that easy back in the days because you could make people fall in love. But now, <laughs> <laughs> and then about two thousand, yeah. they talk about to Koisha. It's just a lot of it's just a beautiful. Where, where can we check it out? It's on YouTube actually. On Another YouTube. chicken licking account. Yeah, uh, definitely will check it out for sure, bro. But yo, welcome to episode fifty four. Fifty four, fifty four. Yeah, fifty four. Yeah, ooh. season two. No, fifty five. Fifty four. Uh, let's let's put a bet on it. Fifty five. Let's bet. So it's it's fifty four. Sure, betty. You, you guys saw that. I Bet don't know. I don't, I don't know what we're betting, uh, but this is episode fifty four. As I'm introducing it, Leo says it's fifty five. <laughs> but this is a boy I'm shooting over shooty. and of course I'm never alone. I'm always with the boy. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? I'm now a screw screw. <laughs> song. That's you know we always start this podcast and never introduce ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah. hey. But, but, but you must work so hard so that you don't have to introduce yourself. Have so. we worked that hard yet? Hey, my nigga, we have 54 episodes. <laughs> and we've <done> five. five. <laughs> According to you. <laughs> also, you're admitting. Okay, fine. Um, but yeah, shout out to us. Shout out to you guys, man. Welcome to episode 54 of Spaza Talk. We've got a couple of things that we want to talk about. And one of them is obviously Bafana Bafana. We've, we've, we've touched it a little bit. But yeah. more than Bafana Bafana, we'll talk about Ronan Williams. Hey, the saver. Yeah, the saver of all savers. The man who could save yeah, relationships yeah, yeah. even. I think banks, when they want to run their savings campaigns, they should just have this guy. Uh, definitely. This guy should be the ambassador for that. He's just he's just a saver. Yeah, he's, he's a saver. Yeah. Like, if you want to explain saving to a kid, yeah. show them a video of this of, of, of Rowan Williams. <laughs> they will know saving. what saving is. Yeah. Then they will start investing in saving. Sure. <laughs> ah, he's, he's the best saver we've ever seen. Bro, South Africa has the best savers. For sure, yeah. Mm. I know this guy could definitely save me um, a lot of money uh, <laughs> on the golf course. I think the Ron, Ron, Ron could even save my golf balls from going yeah. into the water on a golf course. Even he save, save our government money. He could save, uh, he could save, uh, he could save <laughs> our government from a lot of things. <laughs> yeah. Ron and William, shout out to him. He saved four penalties, no? Four. Four penalties. Four. Straight four, my G. That was unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to Ronan. Never Williams. seen in the history, not but in the history of FCON or something. Uh, yeah, like I that. think so. Yeah. yeah. So shout out to him. Shout, shout out. out to him. And then we've got Cape Verde, which is a, a hot topic right now. Hot destination. I, a hot destination. destination. Huh? This, this, I wonder if but we, only for one gender. Okay, sure. Oh, only for one? One gender. Oh, for one yeah. gender. Only for one gender. It's a hot destination. It's a hot destination. Yeah. Because South Africa played Cape Verde. So the news was everybody was looking at the ladies on there and how Bro. beautiful they were, right? Bro. But isn't, doesn't the World Cup always do that? It always shows you, I don't want to say beautiful woman, and no offense to anybody else, but they always show you the the, um, the conventional beautiful woman, you mm. know, the one yellow bone, mm. you know, yeah, they got a weave but, on. But do you think is. the cameras are structured to face that direction? It just looks good. Because it's random, it? right? It, it, it's uh, randomized it, and it happens to land on a dime always. It can't. <laughs> that means the whole country. <laughs> 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 So the, t- the TV shoot on South African gents. Uh, bro, and that's the only thing do, they do you think it's now. propaganda? They're pushing an agenda just <laughs> to get so. us to flock out of yeah. SA yeah, and take our to, women. What if it's ch- Nigeria's strategy, Ved? Hey, to go to Cape Verde and then what? Then no, no, no. You could get rid of us so that they take our women. Whoa. <laughs> do we need a visa to we Cape Verde? We are not Verde. going to Cape Verde. We are going to Cape Verde. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, we see Indy Makatini um, released a video and um, Cindy Makatini, like, she was showing a little bit of body and stuff like that. And so some guy says, uh, Cindy, I don't care what you say, we're still going to Cape Verde. <laughs> <laughs> it was funny, but, you know, it was like, you know, the agenda has always been... But, you know, my problem is this, right? We've never had issues when SA women label us or yes. they say, SA men are this, SA men are short, SA men are what, 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 what. But all of a sudden, when SA <laughs> men fall in love, <laughs> SA men are a problem. So, go to, oh, so, yes, I saw. Yeah, I was like, I am not yet. But it says that, yeah, we need an electronic, yeah, we need a visa. Right? I think we're exempt, bro. I think we can, I think we can go in without them, bro. Yeah, we need to apply online, bro. Oh, so. Does oh. a South African need a visa to get? South African citizens can only apply for a visa on arrival ah, when traveling perfect, to Cape then. Verde. That's perfect. That's perfect. Uh, the visa is issued at Cape Entry Point. That's perfect. perfect. That means you qualify already. <laughs> yeah. You can't go all the way and they turn you back. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so I hope the boys uh, can Our afford boys to fly. Our boys prepare, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do your thing. 
take yourselves in. Sina will take care of the livestock here. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, sina sohla lintsi izo zohlala pha. Yeah, zohlala pha. Sibuka bafanya ba kitchen ba ngeyindiza. But yeah, Cape Verde was an interesting topic. And then we of course South Africans or South African general has just been winning. Yeah, we've got the Grammys. Who's that guy? Trickers. Trickers, he won Boy. before that year. World so it's Cup. just been going. Uh, there's so much That's even Williams, before Trickers. It's just uh, the World Cup. There's mm. so much going on. Mm. Bafana Bafana qualifying. There's more that but, we're even missing out of. Yeah, for sure. But the big news is, of course, Tyler winning the Grammy as the, the Grammy. youngest African. My man. That's amazing, right? She, She's the youngest to African to actually win a Grammy. Age of 22. 22 years old. Yeah, yeah I mean yeah. that's 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 lit if I can say that. Did you see our president actually twerking to the song? I saw him on twerking, stage. But the most the most disturbing guy was the guy next to him. Ay, 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 ay. Homie guy, was going in. That guy was going in. Homie was, I think he was showing us what he does in here. Yeah, I think yeah. we're going to show I you. I know mama. Yeah, we'll show you guys the clip <laughs> as we're speaking here. Ay, 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 ay. The homie was going in. Ay, ay. He knew the tender was cleared, boy. It was like, check cleared, boy. Cleared. <laughs> you know that that was only for cleared mm, tenders. Mm. Uh, but yeah, there were a couple of winners, which was interesting. We know that uh, our album of the year at the Grammys was Taylor Swift. Mm. And then some noteworthy um, mentions um, for at the Grammys I'm looking here is obviously Tyler um, making it um, as best african music performance and she was against asake bena boy davido and yeah, arista some heavyweights eh? yeah some big big heavyweights um but of course there's so many other albums that you know um other categories that were on there and i'm sure some south africans were involved somebody else was on the little dirk one but he's not south african of course but I know he's your favorite <laughs> no not really favorite he's one of those artists that i listen to when i'm not a co- not when i'm not in my rap mode <laughs> when i'm not listening to your joey badass you know? okay okay Z- zooms those conversations don't happen here, <laughs> Baba. <laughs> Lil, Durk, Lil Durk is dope, though. But, uh, he's but, dope, but his music is toxic. His music is toxic? Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. His music, Lil Durk and King Von. Okay, King Von. I know King Von. Music yeah, is so yeah. toxic, my brother. Yeah, yeah. I actually heard that one. But yeah, that's what's happening now in South Africa. And then, of course, we've got Bafana Bafana getting through to the semifinals, playing Shout Nigeria. Them, and then we've got ICJ. Uh, the news at ICJ is that I believe, obviously, after the ruling was that... Um, you know, South Africa is still probing and looking into the thing, and it doesn't look like the genocide is being stopped. So mm. they're still carrying on as they were. So, so they didn't follow a court ruling. They basically. didn't follow the court ruling. Mm. So that's what it feels like the conversation is saying here. Uh, you guys, please correct me if I'm definitely wrong. Um, but Libs, I don't want to make this episode too long because I believe um, people are anticipating watching, you know, Bafana Bafana, who I think are going to win. What do you think? Who's, who I think they're going to win, bro. Because by the time this I comes out, I cut my homies. By the time this comes out, Bafana, yeah, Bafana Bafana would have played in one. Yeah. So you're saying they're going to win? I th- I'm saying they're going to win. Okay, what's, what's, your, what's your score prediction? Uh, in terms of scores, Zooms, hey, you're pushing it, but one nil. <laughs> one nil. <laughs> so the Super Eagles are scoring nothing? Zero. Okay. There's no JJ or coach in that team. So Fair enough. I don't anticipate any goals coming in. I'm saying 2-1. Two, 2-1. One. Two, one. Two, one. Who's going to score first? Um, definitely it's going to be uh, the Super Eagles are yeah. going to score first and then we're going to have to come back uh, from that. And Percy Tau is definitely going to score this time. And I'm, if, it, if, I was, if, it, if I was going to say 3, I was going to say Tau will score 2, but it's 2-1. Two, so Tau will score 1. I don't know who the other will mm. come from. Um, but yeah, without rambling on too much, that's the news that's happening for the week. Should we Seven. get to the mentions? Let's let, no, let's get into the volumes. Okay, the volumes. Yeah. yeah, tell us the volume. Like how many tweets went out last week? Sure, yeah. So now we're seeing um, quite a huge increase, a 9% increase in terms of tweets, right? Oh. Yeah, which is now we're seeing the oh. 7 million. So last yeah. week, this year, we haven't seen a 7 million. And this is the first time we're seeing 7 sure. million. We've been close at 699. Yeah. Now we're seeing at 7.5 million uh, tweets that went out last week. It's like the highest we've seen, actually. Maybe not because last year we see we did see Have seven see something, and I remember us having a conversation about yeah. seven something last seven year. Seven five, but seven yeah. five. It's uh, yeah, yeah. It's a new conversation, but the authors went down, so mm. now we've got an eighteen percent decrease in terms of the people that were tweeting last week on Twitter. So we've got one hundred fourteen thousand people tweeting, which is a decrease, as like I said, by eighteen percent. Sure. Um, and then, yeah, that's basically it in the, in, in in the stats. And then let's look at. I'm gonna look at the sentiment, okay. and then we just look at the word cloud that supports it because that's wow, also important. Wow, in I'm the loving what I'm seeing in in the sentiment. It, I'm loving it. Okay, perfect. I mean, I'm loving. If we're it. looking at the positive, which is a huge increase. 
increase. We're seeing a 16% increase, increase. from the week wow. before. Yeah. All thanks to Tubafana. Tubafana Tuba 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 definitely Tuba has to be. And yeah. Tyler, definitely. And Tyler. Tyler. Yes. Definitely. Yeah. Thanks definitely. to the winners. Yeah, the winners. Yeah. Thanks to all the winners. Yeah, all man. the winners. Shout out to you guys. Now we're seeing over a million tweets that are Woo. positive in South Africa. And I think this is the first time Woo. we are reporting a number like this. Even just the, the percentage jump. Yeah. It's the first time we, we, we're experiencing that. In terms of the negative, we went up by 1%. So that's literally no movement at all. That's um, fine. That's, probably, uh, that's other fender bender stuff. I think yeah. I know what contributed to that. Even. Yeah, sure. So let's look at the negative words that contributed to um, uh, to, to the sentiment last Sh- week. I'm seeing Bibi Mzansi here. Uh, that's the negativity, right? Yeah. So yeah, Bibi Mzansi. There's that lady. What's her name? Li- Liema. Liema. Yeah, I think it's Liema. Yeah, she yeah. was spitting at people. Sure, yeah. I saw people, that, yes. So uh, not a lot of people were impressed on Twitter. Sure, yeah. By her behavior. Did they compare it to a Bravo Yes, team? they did. They did. And they were like, but she has pretty privilege or or ganjan because sure, yeah. she's pretty she's a girl she doesn't get reprimanded as a guy why but why the, is it different I, but, um, if i can chip in uh, that's different dog there's no but, way, those who but, have but you can't that's ray ray that and rape i think are totally different things no this, no, no, this, no i'm not saying yeah. anything is lighter but sure, i think yeah. That's disrespectful to the next person. In general, yeah, on television, yeah. I mean, that shouldn't be. I'm sure they see it as like it's spicy, but no, nobody should be spitting no, on anyone. You shouldn't be and spitting. Like That's if, disrespect. And if, and if somebody slapped back in some degree or to retaliate, exactly. they would have been in trouble. Exactly. Or was it a guy that it was, was back on? Yes, yeah, it, it was, was a guy. guy. Yeah, but that, apparently that guy wasn't that guy messy. Wasn't he kissing like all the girls there? He can do what he likes. He's a grown up. I know. But I mean, just for the show, like I was just like watching. So he was doing all, <laughs> was he really doing? All I, those I, didn't see, I just saw that video on Twitter yeah. of that lady doing her magic. I was like, I'm not into black magic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, this definitely, Bibi Mzanti definitely came up in the negative words. Obviously, ANC also came yeah, up on here. Yeah, yeah. ANC showing up as always, Gaza. Why uh, am I saying money? Money, 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 money. Why is money, money. negative? Money. I think it's. Um, like, is the petrol going up or. Because I know it is going up, but like, why money? <laughs> I see genocide is on here. South genocide Africa. is up there. South Africa is on here. Time yep. is on here. Yep. Uh, but yeah, that's the negative words. And that's the t- negativity. In terms of the positive, we're seeing the biggest word is love. Utandu. Utandu. Okay. Utandu. It is the month of love. It's after the all. month of love, of for course. Sure. And people are loving Bafana. Yeah. Uh, probably saying, love you, Bafana. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, which is actually true. I love this country. I love the sports. Bibi Mzanzi also shows up as a, in, yep. in a positive. Positivity. There's sure. also some great things that they do there. I see the hero, the hero himself. Ronald. Right, the light skin Nelson Mandela, <laughs> the saver of all savers. The saver of all savers. <laughs> Ron <Ronald> himself. <laughs> um, I'm not saying. Ronald I'm Williams. not saying Tyler here, which is interesting. Huh. <laughs> but you know South Africans, they probably don't know her name. We'll probably see water. <laughs> <laughs> Let me actually look. Yeah, they I mean, call water. her water. They're like, ooh, water on. Yeah, it was actually interesting. She's not anywhere on here, but I'm sure in the next coming week she will she will be on here. Yeah. But we're seeing But a, I think under congratulations, that's um, definitely she's possible, also yeah. behind that conversation. Because I see uh congratulations also showing up in the positive For sure, word yeah. cloud. Yeah, and beautiful. Okay, cool. So that's yeah. amazing. And then we've got the busiest days. We've got Wednesdays with 1.2 million mentions, which is for, then followed by Sunday. Yeah, it's followed by Sunday, uh, mainly because of Bafana's performance. Sure, so yeah. the game ended around 12 o'clock. And Absolute, uh, we are Absolute. actually, yeah. So the conversation spilled over to Sunday. Aren't we glad this week it's at seven? Today it's seven. Yeah, yeah. Happy, happy. Yeah. Happy New Year. So it's because of that. So it spilled over. Yeah, the conversation spilled over because about 1 a.m. there were other conversations happening, but we'll get into that. Okay, cool. We'll get into that later. Should we not get into them now, actually? Um, um, or should we do the busiest hour? No, let's, yeah, like, I just wanted to look at the busiest hour. Okay, right? cool. So, like, yeah. What contributed to that, right? So, I'm seeing the busiest hour, obviously, the morning now. The morning? The morning is 8 a.m. and 10 a.m. Sure, yeah. Right? Uh, so, that has changed a slightly bit. Yeah. And then in the evening is now 8 p.m. and 9 p.m. Okay. Yeah. Not which which are about, about the times that you know um we are active and i'm sure yeah, active yeah yeah and today i mean it's going to be an even more testament to it 
especially with the Bafana Bafana game. But we still know that, you know, looking at the trending hashtags, um, reality TV is still trending number one. Mm-hmm. Generally. So I think these times are affected mostly by the reality TV it's, more it's than soccer. Especially 8 p.m. because sure. that's when that's when people actually tune in to be Beam Zans. Okay, on Sundays, yes. Exactly. For the elimination. Exactly. 100%. Okay, nice. Okay, cool. So should we should we get into the conversation or the trending topics? Uh, we can do the trending topics now. Okay, so let's start at number five. Number we've, f- we've got a brand new one. New, new, new one. And I think this is going to be the Kozitoala. Okay. Of this, this big brother Mzans. Oh, yeah. She's going to be the Kozitoala. So number five, we have Zintle Z. Hashtag Zintle Z. Hashtag Zintle Z. And Zintle Z is not spelled Zintle in Zulu. It's, it's with a T. With a T. Yeah. yeah. An H. What, what is that? Is that it's, I don't Swati. Know. It must be Swati. Okay. Z- Z- yeah, that's Swati. It must that's be because in Zulu it's yes, different. Yeah. It's Swati. Yeah. Interesting. Okay, so Zintle Z is trending at number five in South Africa. Zanzi for sure. Sure. So she's got seventeen thousand mentions and thirty-five mm-hmm. million impressions. Yeah, <laughs> she's she's picking up. She's picking up. And I've I've seen like with some of the conversations. So I had a look at some of the tweets, and it's all around support for Zintle and encouraging others to vote for her. Um, and she's she's pers- uh, what's this? She she's. They're already anticipating which she's going to be the one that's taking the grand prize. Really? Of uh, two million rands. I see Papa Ghost is up there too. I keep mentioning Papa Ghost. Is it? Because I see him everywhere. Wow. I don't see him on the chart. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Numbers don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean, Kosi, we saw Kosi started out like this too. She started yep. training in the beginning weeks and then a crowd just kept on following yeah, her. They so just Zinta kept Z, rallying behind her. Yeah, for sure. If Zinta Z's brand is listening... Um, and I'm not going to say copy paste, but copy paste exactly what happened with yep. Kosetwala, and yep. I think you might just be winning specifically. In but the I think there's case. a formula. Zoom. These people, when they go to Big Brother, they probably have managers that side that control uh, what's this, the Twitter army and get people behind that. Sure, because it, even their accounts are like two followers, sure. 180 followers. Like uh, they look dodged. Yeah, yeah. I think it only makes sense. I mean, if I was going into Big Brother, I would also have. Some, I would give my account to somebody else mm. to tweet for me. Mm. So whatever pictures I'm getting, as if I'm the one doing it, which I think is a smart sure. strategy. I would get people to rally behind me because it's two million rand. I mean, if I came up to you and Benjamin, say, Benjamin Lalela, uh, upfront investment to feed to. Nante, 15th hour, uh, please can you help me out while I'm in the Big Brother house, get some soldiers out here. Definitely, um, even for free. Mind yeah, say tata to two meters. Yeah, point. even for free. You get I'll, I'll, I mean? I'll have an airtime campaign in the township where yeah. I'm just giving people airtime, my sure, and telling them where to, what to do. Yeah, right? just SMS, two rand, use the other two rand to be on WhatsApp. Sure, yeah, exactly. So I think it, I think it, like, it can definitely work, and I think um, Zintla Z... And many others could use a strategy yeah. like that. But yeah, yeah. Uh, trending at number five is Zintle, hashtag Zintle Z. And at number four is registered to vote EFF. Yeah, last week it was registered to vote. And um, what's MK? MK, yes. Yes, now it's EFF. But I'm surprised registered to vote just itself is mm-hmm. not trending quite a lot because we've just had re- uh, v- um, re- uh, voter weekend. Uh, uh, what is in registration person. weekend. Yeah, again. registration yeah. weekend, yes. Yeah, I, the IEC man, I think they're slacking when it comes to campaigning. Like, yeah. I, I don't think we should beat around the bush. We I should call I, it what it is. Apparently, it's not an IEC thing. It's a party thing. So the parties are the ones that need to campaign everywhere. And actually no, no, no. The parties are doing their job. Yeah. But the IEC is not doing enough advertising to get people to register to vote yeah you understand yeah you just put it on youtube maybe one sapc you know have a big ass concert sure yeah have a big ass concert where you invite the youth like how the parties are doing it e- e- eff actually did a thingy remember when they had shebe mm, mm, yes. um uh, performing yeah yeah i think yeah. it was in pitoria yes. fountains yeah. yeah yeah i remember that, they should yeah. be doing the same thing not just sending sms's don't forget to vote ah. Nigga, i'm gonna forget to register yeah if you do that yeah you are young my man yeah you are, you a conga, are, you, are yeah. you are busy on a saturday Ish. nobody has time for that you know so yeah man i think they need to wrap up how they how they working on the voting campaigns if they're struggling they can hit us up definitely they can hit us up that is the, but training at number four is the eff eff and then, um, number three number three is Bafana pride, Bafana pride yeah huh? Please can you tell us a little about it? Bafana Pride yeah. with 27,000 mentions and 276 million impressions. Shucks. I think we've just coined a new hashtag. Yeah. You understand? Bafana because Pride, yes. This we've never has heard never this existed. Before. Yeah, we've never heard this before. Would you ever hear it? No. Because we've been losing. <laughs> so how can you see this? Yeah, we can hear really This is different. the first time Twitter has seen this hashtag in its life. Yeah, true. That's true. And true. we are happy for that. Yeah. I, just, I, I hope it keeps showing up. 
because I know even after FCON, we're playing mm-hmm. Algeria and Morocco, I think. Yeah, Algeria, and there's another game. We're going to have to win, though, if we're to carry on. No, no, no. I'm saying outside of FCON. Yeah. There are other games that Bafana is playing. Ish. I think Ho- it's friendlies. Hopefully they win them because we yeah, know we'll support so them So that if this they hashtag win. comes back, it just keeps uh, showing sure, up on the yeah, yeah. trends I, list. I do think this uh, hashtag has been around quite a long time ago, though, and it's only reviving now. But interesting that it's coming in uh, at number three in the top trending hashtag, hashtag Pride, Baf- Bafana Pride. Mm-hmm. And then please can you tell us about number two, bro? Number two, we have FCON 2023. Um, which is still currently playing, yeah. and we are in the semi-finals as South Africa. In case you're watching from outside of Umzans, sure, yeah. Um, so the conversation got eighty-eight thousand mentions and one point two billion impressions. Whoa! Yeah, yeah. It's currently the biggest conversation in right. in Africa, in right, Africa now. right now. Yeah. yeah. I mean, look as we get outside closer. of Cape Verde, of course. Uh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, of course. And I mean, look, we are at the semifinals now and really going into the finals. So definitely there's a big conversation in South Africa yep. too. And I'm sure it is a big, big conversation in other countries too. But at number one... Um, yeah, we know number one. It's going to be number one for the next couple of months. Yeah. Bibi, Bibi Mzans. Sure. With uh, 219,000 mentions and 862 million, uh, million impressions. So, yeah, Sias Genzagali and Liyama did what she did to run L's. L's, yes. I think the guy's L's. Yeah, they did some, they pulled some L's on L's. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, they gave him some L's for real, man. Being spat on is not, yeah, it's not cool. Yeah. But anyway, I mean. And then we have a bonus. We have a bonus. A bonus. I think I had, I had to deep dive. I had to do Amajita and give them enough information around this. If if there was someone from Travel Start, I was going to ask them to come in today so that <laughs> Azoba Nigama packages, like, you are know, you, with, you, what time of the year you should sure. go there, those so kind of things. So you think there could be a boys trip on the way? Hey, not for me, man. Yes, yes, <laughs> for the boys. For the boys, yeah. yeah. I, can, I can be the boys, the boys. with the pilot there yeah, yeah. and transport them and come back. Okay, sure. And pick them up again. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be there to take photos. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> Good one. Yeah, yeah. Good one. So... Cape Verde is um, our bonus, yeah. right? I didn't just look at the hashtag. I look at the hashtag and the keyword because not everyone is going to hashtag, hashtag Cape Verde. Yeah. yeah, I understand. It's, 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 part of, um, it's part of the Twitter conversation. Yeah, sure, I understand. Yeah, yeah. So basically the, the, uh, the name Cape Verde got 53,000 mentions. Okay. And 21,000 unique authors. So there were over 21,000 people that were contributing to this hashtag. Jeez. Right? And there's more Zooms. This conversation peaked like its highest peak. Sure, yeah. When I had a look there, like it was the highest of all highs. I can right? see. I mean, what were the, the, the things that were on there is about Cape, Cape Verdean women, right? Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> so the conversation peaked after the game to show yeah, that yeah. it's something else now. Yeah. It's not Bafana. Yeah. It's Cape Verde. It's the rise of Cape Verde. Sunday at 1 a.m. Okay. Homies were still awake. Uh, it was searching. T- tweeting. Oh, the sure. searching part, I'm going to get into it Okay, now. okay. Th- this was tweeting, my G. They were tweeting hard about, at that time. About Cape Verde. About Cape Verde. <laughs> and then I did another search and I was like, no, 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 man. If people are tweeting so much, they're probably going on YouTube and Google yeah. to, to check out Cape Verde women. For sure, yeah. And yay, I'm right. So that search uh, started um, picking up from the uh what time 11 p.m so peeps were searching now searching cape verde woman and then at 1 a.m 2 a.m actually that's when it peaked the highest peak guys were searching now it's still happening till today so yeah man the peaks have like yeah this conversation has been happening since the fourth so I'm guessing Sunday. Yeah. Right? In the evening, it peaked on the 3rd, uh, 11 p.m. Okay, okay. And then it kept on going. Till this day, it's still, people are still searching <laughs> on YouTube and on Google for Cape Verde women. That's the phrase they're using. Oh, shucks. Yeah. Okay. And then, um, there was, so we basically saying this is the rise of vendor. I need to go to video. It is. Uh, on, 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 on Twitter, where yeah. this lady was like, 
uh, the guys want to go to Cape, Ve- Cape Vanda. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they want to go to Cape Vanda. Yeah, so the, the gents have changed it this morning. They're like, hey, guys, why are we diving straight into the main course? Yeah. Uh, why are we diving straight into dessert when we're forgetting the main course right here, <laughs> which is Cape Vanda? <laughs> Cape Vanda right there. Oh, man. Uh, but yeah, that's the bonus for the week, right? Yeah, so yeah. We definitely know Cape Vanda was a big topic in South Africa. And obviously, like I said, you know, we can travel there. We gave you guys some information on traveling on there. And obviously, just the stats around that. And then let's go to the guys that are earning the most money. So, Getting or earning bucks, money on Twitter bucks, rather in South bucks. Africa. And we're looking at the top Twitter. So, we're using a tool called Brandwatch. And definitely check it out if you have never checked it out to pull this information. So, at number five, we've got Troll Football. Yeah. I, I really football. like this account. I really like this account because yeah. Troll Football is a football account, right? Yes. So, they tweet everything football yeah but you are able to to have a handle take over okay for a set duration of time yeah so like currently as we're speaking the handle is being used to advertise on the profile by a gambling site oh sure okay. so the information on the um, on the bio is about the gambling site yeah. and then but the content is still around football, football itself yeah, yeah for sure which is uh, incredible man. yeah sure so we're seeing eighteen thousand mentions and 121 million impressions coming at number five at troll football and then at number four is our returner has jenny yeah again. has jenny yeah. yeah and like we said the last time there's nothing special that has jenny does yeah but she just puts out tweets that people resonate with so she's found, so clearly she's found a formula now she's right? found she, a formula she's coming back to again. tap into mzansi sure yeah i think has jenny is from the from um from the u.s okay sure yeah yeah, yeah definitely so we're seeing twenty two thousand mentions and 69 million impressions and then Another uh, returner, your, 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 your other fave. Yeah, my fave, yeah. Destiny Z. Um, number three this time around with 26,000 mentions and 245 million impressions. Shout out here. Yeah. If you're definitely looking for um, for some quick content or a roundup of what happened for the day, definitely check it out yep. under the hashtag in case you missed it. That is at number three. Uh, at in Destiny fact, Z. it's not even for the day. It's like a roundup every hour. Every hour. Yeah, yeah, every yeah, hour yeah, Every hour, yeah. <laughs> You're definitely going to see one before the funnel funny yep. game. After, yep. Yeah, definitely. And then coming at number two is Chris Axel. Ah, the most toxic. The most toxic. Ow. But his friends are not around him. About Edvon, about one by now. So is, uh, his account is suspended. I know. Yeah, his account is suspended. Well, Ute, what Edvon. did he do? I don't know. Someone not not all know, but you know what it's I mean. Porno. <laughs> oh, it's porno. Oh, it's porno. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, I think so. Oh, no. That's what got him into trouble. Oh, and you know, I mean, as much as we know, we think the guy's like, you know, a well known figure, there's many speculations about him, but you can't escape Twitter Global. Like, if they ban you, they ban you. Like, nah, it's like trying to escape what's this, the FBI or Interpol. It's not happening. You can't go anywhere in the world. You can escape SABs. (laughs) <laughs> with a bribe Nyan or something with a bribe Nyan or you can cross over to Lesotho <laughs> or Swaziland Interpol yeah it's a different story you. yeah so Chris Axel coming at number 2 and the most mentioned with 35,000 mentions and 227 million impressions hmm and then we've got a new number 1 new number 1 and I need to we need to clap Oof. slow clap build oh, up it's Come on, boys. Bafana, 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 number one. The boys and the girls, come on. <laughs> uh, shout out to Bafana Bafana coming in at number one in South Africa as yep. the most mentioned. So Bafana Bafana is also earning some money from uh, It's from, earning from some Twitter. money. But I think this money should go to the goalkeeper straight. Uh, only to him. Only yeah. to him. Eish. But that's unfair. I mean, everybody else worked in the other games. Okay, okay, Zooms, they can share. He can get 50%. They can share the rest of the 50. Okay, fine. Yeah. So they've got 660 million impressions and 46,000 mentions. That's quite a lot. That's a lot 660 million impressions yeah. is quite a lot. And I must say, like, if the whole country actually had to tag Bafana Bafana, I think we would see stupid numbers. Yeah. Um, yeah. Because each, each person is tweeting about 20 times sometimes on sure. Twitter. Um, sure. yeah, go, go, Percy at Bafana yeah. Bafana. Shoot at my funny, you know. You almost said go pork, and eh? uh, no way. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm used to saying go pork. <laughs> it's very rare to say go <laughs> before. <laughs> exactly. And you know, it doesn't even sound right. Go for no, it's go boys. Even yeah, no. But yes, coming at number one is Bafana Bafana, trending at number one in South Africa as the most mentioned, not trending number one, sorry, mm. as the most mentioned in South Africa. And next I presume week. next week's uh, episode is going to have Bafana Bafana as the number one again. Mm-hmm. Uh, whether we win or lose, I think mm-hmm. it'll be that kind of conversation. Yep. 
Yeah, for sure. Yep. So let's look at ad of the week. Yeah, that's a new segment we have. We've sure, yeah. it now, right? Uh, just to round up the show. Yeah. So Cyril is going to choose his favorite ad for okay, the week. Yeah, yeah. And I'll choose my favorite ad. Yeah, sure. We all, I mean, this is just a segment we're adding for this week, which I think is super, super interesting. So I came across two ads. And uh-huh. one of them was um, by Clockwork Media. I'm just mentioning the agency for those who want to know. But definitely, we'll put a link on these. I'm gonna show, we're going to show you guys snippets of the ads also a little bit just so you see them. But check out the links. Uh, one of them was about drunk driving and about basically like say, uh, saying like don't don't drink and drive and um, yeah it was a beautiful campaign it's quite long to explain but I will put a link on there we'll sure. also show you a little bit about it um, uh, which I found very interesting it was just I can't believe we always have to be reminded to don't to not drink and drive true true it's so crazy like that sounds like a common thing like don't drink and drive like. But what they were showing in the ad was like, you know, jail sales is like yeah. being advertised as holidays. Wow. Um, but there's a clever concept in how they did yeah, it. That like, hits, eh? Yeah, it definitely hits. And it was a whole different message. And I definitely urge you guys to check it out. Get ready for another festive season on South Africa's roads, where over half of all deaths are caused by alcohol. But just like the cigarettes and safe sex warnings, drunk driving messages often go ignored because South Africans are more afraid of prison than of dying. We went where no other drink driving campaign has ever been, on holiday with them. And in my other ad, I know, I'm sorry, I have two today. Okay. And in my other ad was MTN You showed me that one. Yeah. Uh, it's a beautiful ad. I yeah, like which, it. Wait, which ad are you going to talk about, actually? Me? Yes. I finish. I have mine. <laughs> <laughs> you want to steal my ad? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was talking too much. But it's MTN Kids. Um... And briefly, the ad, I think it's like about this kid who makes things happen. Yeah, uh, like this kid is changing changing the world just by making calls. Yeah, right? yeah. Called, yeah. Um, I think it was one of the ministers while they were presenting oil. Uh, they wanted a new partnership with another country. So it was an oil trade. Yeah. And then because of that kill, ma- uh, that, hey, that kill, yeah, hey, uh, negativity, uh, <laughs> <laughs> stop it. Because yeah. uh, that kid um, went on screen. And then oh, she made that? everyone laugh. <laughs> yeah, and then everyone laughed, and then the deal pulled through. Like a lot of things yeah. were changed and were made better because of that phone call. Yeah, an amazing ad. Definitely, it's called MTN Babies. We've seen MTN Babies before, mm. um, quite a long time ago. MTN has been playing around with babies, babies. quite a while, making phone calls. Sure, we, we know both babies they pay the these babies. exist. They have to. I'm sure these kids I don't pay the mom, pay the baby. I don't trust the mom. Do you think that kid at such as that age can act like that? Do you think it's AI? Hello? Bye. Well, everybody's heard about the bird of the night. Bird, bird, a bird is the bird of the night. Bird, bird, bird is the bird of the night. Don't you know about the bird? Well, everybody knows that the bird is the bird of the night. Bird, bird, a bird is the bird of the night. I'm I'm convinced something is happening. Like they're doing some manipulation. Cause I mean that kid acted, bro. That kid was like pressing. Yeah. Hello. Like. Ah, but, uh, but they do that zooms. These kids, they don't need training. These kids play with your phone. Okay, fine. On on set with like maybe lights and everything. Try telling a kid, okay, do okay, do it again. And true. on cue. True. 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 This <laughs> and is exactly coming. Like, this is coming again, from like, zooms himself. So. Hey man, I can't argue that. Yeah, but a very interesting ad. Lebs, what's your what's your ad? Uh, my ad actually. So I wanted to say I'm a glug glug, right? Cause, yeah. Because <laughs> because of today's game. Yes, right? yes. But then there was something I was reading on walk around culture. Yeah. And one thing really stood out for me because they were talk. They 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 said there's two two types of um, uh, two types of people, right? people whatever situations yeah it's either you contribute to culture yeah because you know a lot of brands like tapping into culture whether it's the gaming community because of that culture of gaming sure, or, yeah oh uh, these younger kids i'm a piano culture whatever but now what they're saying as a brand maungena in that space you must contribute don't always exploit because ah. some people get in there to get what of they course, want yeah. and they don't give back yes. right and um my, my Kulmangale Yose team, we also looked at some of the ads and how to create a, if let's say a brand is not from here, 
but you want to advertise here. Yeah. They're saying don't lose the essence of where the brand is coming from. Ooh. So if it's, a, if it's a UK brand, like Land Rover, for example, we want to buy a piece of, of Britain. Yes. We want to buy a piece of, of England, whatever. Yeah. So why may we change? Am I figure last like maybe South African brand. So we to Rover. Ah. No, still bring it here like that. But so when you create Rover. the ads, right? <laughs> When you create the ads, just make sure you still have that same uh, subject, whatever it is, whatever product it is. But the setting, that's where you can play around. Sure. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You can place it in hell. So who did you say this is by? No, no. I'm about to get into okay, the Okay, okay, right? okay, okay. So one, one, one brand that has done it so well for me, uh, it's, it's one example that I can remember. It's Tropica. Yes. There's this ad that they have where uh, the setting is still in Jamaica. Yes. Because Tropica is you know, a tropical island type yeah, of thing. Yeah. But then the context, what was in the video was around South Africa. Yeah. I'm a potholes. There okay. were potholes in that <laughs> video. There were it's to, yeah. to 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 what's this to pass your driver's license yeah, type yeah, of thing. You yeah. know, load shedding. There was no <laughs> shedding. Yeah, yeah, all all our typical island. problems. Yes, all those problems were there. So meaning good, even if it's a brand that's foreign, but you can still make it feel homely for the people that are here. For sure. Maybe yeah. adding a flavor. Yeah, yeah, yeah local. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Tropica, yeah. Sure, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ay, 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 ay. I love Tropica and I'm a big fan of Tropica actually. Anybody who knows me knows I'm a huge advocate of Tropica. I love no there's no Archer can go in Tropica. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's, okay, it's, no, it's tried, probably by Clover, right? I tried. I tried so by Clover. Yeah. yeah. So who do, who did you say the brand was? It is Tropica. Tropica. Yeah. Oh, oh, shucks. Okay. So I thought you were making an example. No, no, no. It's Tropica. Okay. So we'll play the ad after this. Actually, we'll have the link in the description. I definitely so want to check. Out I want to check it ads. out. Trop, tro, I love Tropica, guys. Yeah. Hey, just check it out, there, especially the. Yeah, it was my fave. In yeah. Tropica was like my number one. My Tropica new- and was it in Samoa's? Yeah, yeah my in Samoa's so, too. Yeah, uh, remember you could. That's a combo. Remember, that's a Valentine combo. Boy. It used to be a Valentine's yeah, combo. combo. It boy. used to be a Valentine's combo, but I'm a guy. Yeah, and now my mom would come back with those things during Valentine. Yeah, uh, it's Samoa's. Tro- ne- but ne- I would finish all. It, of it. Tropica used to be the ish. Yep. But it's still it used to be topical. <laughs> hey, hey, yeah, it's still what the, I did there. Definitely still the edge to me um, and to us. I would love some tropical. I'm going to give you a little bit of tropical. So now let's. Yeah, let's see. The fish. Yeah, this is the fish. Yeah, they want a combo. Then after was Nama Piskit. Nama Piskit. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But uh, is that everything for the week, bro? Ah, that's everything. I think we can call it, man. We can close the show. Yeah, yeah. So, we're going to have a fun. Sam's a good boys. Good luck to the boys. It's starting now, now. It's starting now, now. Um, But yeah, definitely. Uh, shout out to uh, Bafana Bafana. Shout out to Tyler. Shout out to all the winners. In shout South out to Africa. South Africans. Shout out to, sh- to South Africans as a whole. Shout yeah. out to you guys as our listeners for listening to Spaza Talk every single week as we bring you guys the stats. Obviously powered by Brandwatch and by, powered by Color Space, of by course. Color Space, man. We work hard. Yeah, we for must sure. Give Color Space a shout out. For sure. For we sure. are employed by them. For sure. Yeah. Shout out to Color Space. Shout out to Brandwatch. Make sure you check them out. We'll put also the links below in the description on how to get a hold of them. But this is episode 54 of Spaza Talk. Umshuti Wabashuti is calling this. And we are out. Peace. Ciao.